Welcome to World in Two Minutes. These are your headlines. The final obstacles to a nuclear deal between Iran and six world powers seem to have been cleared. Negotiators in Vienna have been trying to limit Iran's nuclear program in exchange for lifting sanctions. A senior diplomat now says the compromise reached would allow the UN to inspect Iranian nuclear sites, but only after asking for permission. A formal announcement is expected later on Tuesday. The Greek parliament has until Wednesday to pass reforms demanded by Eurozone members in exchange for Greece's third bailout. The reforms include raising taxes and pension reform. But the Greek Prime Minister Alexis Tsipras may have a difficult time getting the support he needs. Defense Minister Panos Kamenos has come out against the measures. He referred to the situation as a coup. New York City has paid $5.9 million to the family of Eric Garner. Garner died in police custody last year. The city's medical examiner determined that an officer's illegal chokehold contributed to Garner's death. A New York City jury chose not to indict the officer, but a federal investigation is ongoing. His family had asked the city for $75 million. The city has not admitted any liability. Garner's death is one in a series in the last year that have sparked protests against police brutality directed at minorities in the U.S. North Korea has constructed bicycle lanes along major roads in the capital, Pyongyang. Collisions between bicycles and pedestrians are common because most cyclists ride on the sidewalk. Thanks for watching. TRTWorld.com, Istanbul.